BrainWise presents Grade 6 Math Quiz B Part 1 Yo, mathletes! Think you've got what it takes to be a math master? Prove it! We've got a crazy math challenge with questions that'll make your brain do backflips. Don't worry, we'll start off easy peasy. Grab your pencils, smash that like button, and let's do this. Easy round. Number one. Liam had two thirds of a chocolate bar. He gave one quarter of his chocolate to his friend. What fraction of the whole chocolate bar did his friend receive? Again, Liam had two thirds of a chocolate bar. He gave one quarter of his chocolate to his friend. What fraction of the whole chocolate bar did his friend receive? A. 1 6th B. 1 12th C. 5 12 D. 11 12 The correct answer is 1 6th Number 2 if n minus 5 equals 11, what is the value of n? Again, if n minus 5 equals 11, what is the value of n? A, 6, B, 16, C, minus 6, D, 55. The correct answer is 16. Number 3. The ratio of cats to dogs at a pet shelter is 5 is to 3. If there are 15 cats, how many dogs are there? Again, the ratio of cats to dogs at a pet shelter is 5 is to 3. If there are 15 cats, how many dogs are there? A. 9 B. 25 C. 18 D. 6 The correct answer is 9. Number 4. What is 10% of 350? Again, what is 10% of 350? A. 3.5 B. 35 C. 70 D. 315 The correct answer is 35. Number 5. A recipe for cookies uses one half cup of sugar and one quarter cup of butter. If you want to make half the recipe, how much butter will you need? Again, a recipe for cookies uses one half cup of sugar and one quarter cup of butter. If you want to make half the recipe, how much butter will you need? A. 1 16th cup. B. 1 8th cup. C. 1 6th cup. D. 1 half cup. The correct answer is 1 8th cup. Wow, you crushed that easy round. But don't get too comfortable. Things are about to get a bit trickier. Are you ready to step up your game? Let's dive into the average round. Average round. Number 1. A painter uses one-third of a gallon of paint to cover one-quarter of a wall. How many gallons of paint will he need to cover the whole wall? Again, a painter uses one-third of a gallon of paint to cover one-quarter of a wall. How many gallons of paint will he need to cover the whole wall? A. One-twelfth gallon B. Three-quarters gallon C. One and one-third gallons D. Four-thirds gallons
correct answer is one and one third gallons. Number two, simplify the following expression. Again, simplify the following expression. A, Y plus eight. B, Y plus two. C, seven Y plus eight. D, seven Y plus two. The correct answer is Y plus eight. Number three, the ratio of red balloons to blue balloons is two is to five. If there are 14 red balloons, how many balloons are there in total? The ratio of red balloons to blue balloons is two is to five. If there are 14 red balloons, how many balloons are there in total? A, 35. B, 21. C, 49. D, 70. The correct answer is 49. Number four, a store is having a buy two get one free sale on shirts. This is the same as what percentage discount? Again, a store is having a buy two get one free sale on shirts. This is the same as what percentage discount? A, 20%, B, 25%, C, 30%, D, 33.33%. The correct answer is 33.33%. Number 5. David ate two-fifths of a pizza and Emily ate one-third of the same pizza. What fraction of the pizza is left? Again, David ate two-fifths of a pizza and Emily ate one-third of the same pizza. What fraction of the pizza is left? A. 4 fifteenths B. 11 fifteenths C. 1 fifteenth D. 14 fifteenths The correct answer is 4 fifteenths. Congratulations on making it this far. Now, prepare for the final boss of math problems. These are tough, but I believe in you. Let's see what you can do with the difficult round. Difficult round. Number one, a recipe for pancakes calls for one and one half cups of flour and three quarters cup of milk. If you only have one half cup of milk, how much flour should you use to keep the same ratio? Again, a recipe for pancakes calls for one and one half cups of flour and three quarters cup of milk. If you only have one half cup of milk, how much flour should you use to keep the same ratio? A, one quarter cup, B, one half cup, C, three quarters cup, D, one cup.
correct answer is one cup. Number two, simplify the following expression. Again, simplify the following expression. A, 8A plus 5. B, 8A plus 11. C, 6A plus 5. D, 6A plus 11. The correct answer is 8 A plus 5. Number 3. The ratio of boys to girls in a class is 5 is to 4. If 3 more boys and 3 more girls join the class, what is the new ratio of boys to girls? Again, the ratio of boys to girls in a class is 5 is to 4. If 3 more boys and 3 more girls join the class, what is the new ratio of boys to girls? A. 8 is to 7, B, 5 is to 4, C, 2 is to 1, D, 3 is to 2. The correct answer is 8 is to 7. Number 4. A shirt is on sale for 20% off. If the sale price is $24, what was the original price of the shirt? Again, a shirt is on sale for 20% off. If the sale price is $24, what was the original price of the shirt? A. $28.80 B, $30. C, $32. D, $36. Correct answer is $30. Number 5. Three friends share a bag of candies. Alice eats one quarter of the candies, Bob eats two fifths of the candies, and Carol eats the rest. What fraction of the candies did Carol eat? Again, three friends share a bag of candies. Alice eats one quarter of the candies, Bob eats two fifths of the candies, and Carol eats the rest. What fraction of the candies did Carol eat? A. 11 twentieths B. 9 twentieths C. 7 twentieths D. 3 tenths The correct answer is 7 twentieths. Whoa, that was intense! If you made it through the difficult round, give yourself a huge pat on the back. You've officially conquered the ultimate math challenge. 
How did you do? Let me know your score in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more math fun. Did you enjoy the quiz? What's your score? Comment it below. If you want more of these content, leave a like and share this with your friends. You may subscribe to the channel as well. Check out other videos from Brainwatch.